Hello YouTube. Welcome to the next episode of The Shade. I have some serious shade for you today. Let's talk about shopping at the mall shade. First of all, I want to say to you, have you ever been out and just wanted to go shopping? You had some regular clothes on just like I have on. You have a short little handbag and then on top of that you got your favorite little sneakers on. Well, I wanted to say to you that sometimes you can go in a store dressed just like me and nobody makes a big deal out of it but do you ever feel sometimes you get ignored in the store like you really don't want to buy anything even though you really do and you have a hard time getting some customer service because they figure you have on regular clothes and you look kind of beat up a little bit so you know you can possibly want to buy anything but Let's do a transformation here, and then I'll tell you the rest of my story. Okay, I came in a store like this one day, and I just had a regular little bag just like this, and I had this sweatsuit on. I had these sneakers on, and I was just looking around because I was going to come back at another time to buy something, but I was treated as if what I wanted to see or what I was trying to find out did not matter. I was not acknowledged. And basically, I was watched as if I was going to take something. Okay, so now we're going to do the transformation. Here's the transformation. All I'm going to do is change. First of all, I'm going to change my clothes. Okay. Change my clothes. That's the reason why I had my jacket up to my throat, if you were wondering why. I'm going to change my sunglasses. Let's get rid of those. And I'm going to put on a different kind of sunglasses. And I'm also going to take down my hair. I'm going to take down my hair. I'm going to comb it out. And we're going to see a transformation of the difference between when you're just kicking it and you're just window shopping as opposed to wanting to actually buy something because you intend on coming back the next day to buy something or maybe a couple of days or maybe you're waiting for a good time to come back and you just want to price some things okay yeah my hair's not perfect but I came back I had my sunglasses on I had my hair comb let me put on a little bit of lipstick here so we can give some a little something something to it I put my favorite necklace on you know I had one of those days to myself but I actually had some time to get myself dressed and I wasn't jogging I wasn't running I wasn't kicking it with my girlfriends and just window shopping I was actually coming out to do some shopping for myself okay I'm comb my hair out a little bit here and try not to knock off my glasses while I'm doing it and try to create something here to make myself look like I normally would when I go out and I'm trying to get my shop on. Okay. But I'm going to keep it real plain and simple. Okay. So this is what I did. I came back a few days later. I had this blouse on. And I had this necklace on. Okay. And I had some other accessories to go along with it. No need to explain. I also came carrying this bag, which is a very nice bag. And it just happens to match my outfit. And it just happens to match my glasses with a little punch of pink color in it. And I had on a pair of plain white pants or jeans. And I was wearing these shoes right here. You know, cool shoes, but you can find them. And next thing I know, I went to my cabinet and I sprayed a little bit of perfume. You know, some Chanel number no. 5 or whatever kind of nice perfume that you like. And I go back into the store. The treatment of myself was totally different. I was greeted when I came to the door. I was asked if I needed any help within the first five minutes in the store and 
I was also told where I could get something else, you know, if I was looking for it to go with what I was trying to purchase. But at the same time, I felt like I was still the same person, just dressed differently. But at the same time, I felt uncomfortable because the day before, I was still clean. I was still neat. I didn't smell. But you tell me what you think. If you think it was shade, let me know how that works out. If you don't think it was shade, or you have an opinion, or you've ever felt this way before, please let me know. Because I think it's time that people stop treating people based on the way they appear to them. Everybody wants to be loved. Everybody wants to look nice. And I really, really, truly believe that everybody deserves equal treatment. Now, we know we have a couple people who sometimes come in the store and they don't quite do what they're supposed to do and sometimes cause a little ruckus. But majority of people come in stores and act like they have some sense. So let me know if the shade should be pulled down halfway, all the way, or the shade pulled completely down with the curtains closed. Thank you and have a blessed day.